Following this developing story, two people in custody after a deadly stabbing attack in Northwest Miami-Dade. One man was airlifted to the hospital where he later died. We were able to speak to those who say they were close to that victim. Local 10's Trent Kelly is live with us uh, with what we are learning about that man. Trent. Yeah, Alexis, we know that uh, stabbing attack did happen very early yesterday morning at a mobile home park in a remote park of Northwest Miami Dade. That stabbing attack leaving one man dead, two others now said to be in police custody. And this morning we're hearing from a friend of that stabbing victim who says she's now left wondering how and why something like this would even happen. Shocked when I heard that he passed away. Everybody loved him. Friends and loved ones shocked to learn of the death of 30 year old Richie Chavarius. Chavarius stabbed to death after getting into a fight early yesterday morning. Police say it happened at this mobile home park on Northwest 185th Street near Chrome Avenue in a remote part of Northwest Miami Dade. It was there that Chavarius began fighting with two other people, one of whom pulled out a knife and stabbed Chavarius multiple times. Paramedics rushing him to HCA Aventura Hospital in critical condition where Chavarius later died. Police taking two people into custody at the scene on Saturday as those who knew Chavarius now wonder why someone would want to kill their friend. He always helped everybody. He was, the, he was funny. He like basically he just liked to help people. Everybody here really like really liked him. And so far, the names of those two people who were uh, arrested by police yesterday have yet to be released. It's also not clear what charges they will be facing as a result of all of this. By the way, we did reach out to Chavarius's family yesterday, but they declined to comment. For now, that is the latest outside MDPD headquarters in Doral this morning. I'm Trent Kelly, Local 10 News.